great winners of this race in recent years. Swing band for Ryan Bell. Yeah, so Ryan knows how to win it. He's got Ray Wave Rider here. Just about set. And they're racing and flying out. Armour Believer from the outside is going to cross, I think, although going quickly is Ideal Muscle inside of it. Ideal Muscle hunts through on the inside of Armour Believer and they burn away early by eight metres. Two core can run on Opal Hunter. He just didn't have the speed. Drives through, can't get leaders back, though. Armour Believer gets there first. So the favourite in all sorts here is three back the inside, Opal Hunter. And while that's happening, Artful Major gets beautifully in the 1-1 one -one for Hall Jr. On the back of core can run. Getting to the inside is Grievous getting a soft trip four back from Quinton, who's outside the stable mate, Dark Eyes. Wave Rider travelling comfortably early as fourth last outside of He's a Vibe. Back second last is Bet the House for Ronnie Houston, who won a Fremantle Cup with Jumbo Operator. He's second last in the Caduceus as Artful Major goes to the breeze. And last of all is Then You Came Along. Going into the back, lead time quick at 36 seconds and it's Ideal Muscle out in front. Leading the way by four or five metres. Armour Believer on the inside. The outside is Artful Major. And back on the inside is Opal Hunter. And being covered on the outside by Court Can Run and Edget and Green. Next of all, Quinton, who's over on the outside of Grievous. Dark Eyes covered by Wave Rider. And well back third last, Bet the House for Vokes, suited by that quick lead time. He's on the back of Wave Rider. And Wave Rider pulls three wide and Vokes off immediately onto his back with Bet the House. He's the vibe, the centre. And pulling out wide as Denny came along as Denny Roberts looks for four winners tonight. Down the straight they run. First quarter in 29-6 and it's ideal muscle for Aiden DeCampo. Leading up for Major Armour Believer, three wide Wave Rider. Court can run the centre. The inside Opal Hunter. Bet the House Travelling really strongly out wider. He's on the back of Wave Rider. And then came Quinton and well back as Grievous taken wide. Then you came along. He's survived the centre. Dark Eyes the inside at the 650. 29 for the second quarter. Into the back. Ideal Marcel in front. Out three wide is Wave Rider. Out full majors under pressure trying to respond. Out back on the inside is Armour Believer. Bet the House continues to work into the race very nicely as Wave Rider hits the front. Bet the House giving chase. And they're about to come away from the field as they come off the back straight. Wave Rider in front. Bet the House is giving chase out wider. They drop off Artful Major, Ideal Muscle to the outside. Then you came along. Denny's still got a chance here. Opal Hunter gets to the outside but might be too far away around the turn. Bet the House, the outside just in front. Wave Rider's responding. 28-2 and then then you came along. It's Wave Rider and Bet the House in a ding-dong go. Wave Rider the inside. Bet the House, the outside. Then nose for nose. Wave Rider. Bet the House. Bet the House draws to the front. Vakes done it and Bet the House won the Caduceus. Bet the House first from Wave Rider in a terrific battle. They raced away from Armour Believer. Fourth, I think then you came along. Grievous flashed up late the inside, followed by Opal Hunter and further back, Dark Eyes Artful Major got tired. Well back was Ideal Muscle who also hit the wall from Quinton Court Can Run and he's a vibe. Bet the house, number 12 is the winner. Big win. Vokes got a very high opinion of this horse. Ronnie Houston, who I mentioned, won the Fremantle Cup with Jumbo Operator in 2007. And uh, that's a brilliant win for Ronnie here. The second Ronnie to win tonight. Owner Ronnie winning earlier with middle page. And this time trainer Ronnie, Ronnie Houston winning with Bet the House. It's 12 beating 7. What a race that was. They came right away. They looked the Quinella from about the, uh, probably even at the bell, Wave Rider was cruising up and Bet the House was on its back. They'd gone hard early. And then they swept to the lead together off the back. And uh, it was a bit uh, Waverly Star bone crusherish at the 400 when they took off and went together. Had they gone too early? No, was the answer. And Bet the House over the top. One and a quarter, eight and three quarters, 12, seven, eight and six. 12, 7, 8 and 6. So 6 holds fourth. Then you came along just in front of 11 Grievous who got up on the inside late. 1 and a quarter, 8 and 3 quarters, 5 and a half.